Hello, welcome to my channel. My name is Alicia. Today I have a new box to my channel. This is the Bombay and Cedar Beauty Box. This is another one of my lovely, I can't sleep, so I order random beauty boxes. So, um, this is $31.95. Shipping, I believe it's free, and so I think I pay a couple dollars tax. So I think for me it came out to be around $33.00. So I will probably be a little um, more critical because I, I, if possibly, because I want to see if I get my value. So for 30 some dollars, I really want there to be a lots of value. Um, I love the outside sticker. It says, um, basically it says the Beauty Box by Bombay and Theater, clean, vegan, and cruelty free, which I really like. Um, so this is what it looks like in the inside. It comes in a bag. This is the September box. So they are behind on shipping on their lifestyle and their beauty. Beauty is not so bad. Um, I do like that you get a product card. So it looks like we have six items. This is one where you do get to choose one. So this, um, I would say, is just a standard shopping bag maybe a hair heavier than a shopping bag, but it is a plastic bag. Um, so anyway, okay. So I'm just taking out all the products. All right. So the first item I am seeing is a blush and it looks like this is a blush kit. 50 sheets sponge applicator with five adhesives. That sounds interesting. So they say this is an $18 value. Give your cheeks a natural looking flush of color and delicate glow with this multitasking product. Create a multi-dimensional look with this weightless, with that is weightless on your skin. So I am uh, a little interested in this. So it comes in a little plastic case. It's got a nice mirror here. Uh, a sponge and then it looks like there are sheets. So I'm, I'm not thinking I'm going to remove the sheets um, because it will probably go in a giveaway. Here is the color if you can see that. Um, so I'm interested, see this is my problem when we, we're getting skincare and makeup is that I don't do much with makeup. So I don't know, I'm scared about this product. Have anybody, have any of you guys ever used uh, sheets that you'd, I guess, transfer to your face? Uh, it's a pretty color. So I don't know, I may try that. I, I'm a little scared by that product. Next up, it says Facial Polish Bonbon. Um... Take a single heart and apply a thin layer of product by massaging on moist skin, avoiding the eye. Leave on for three to five minutes and then rinse with warm water. Specifically formulated with herbal extracts to help cleanse, hydrate, moist, and nourish. This is $28. So it looks like you could have gotten multiple, uh, there are different maybe flavors. I got purple, which is guava and passion fruit. So the seal was already off. I mean, it does not, does not really bother me. So they are soft. I'm going to have residue on my finger. So they're like a little heart. Um, smells good. So I'm interested to try these. Um, I'm, since it says polish, I assume that means a uh, exfoliant. So interesting. I've uh, never seen that. Um, I'm interested to try it. It feels soft, which I like, because I know I got some kind of like body scrub cube in like a Fat Fit Fun, and those were like literally worse than sandpaper, I think. All right, next up, this has been a popular thing. I know I mentioned this in one of my other videos, in that I feel like uh, subscription boxes come out with like, if one has, like I got like three boxes in a row that had facial oil, never received a facial oil or balm before, now I have three of them. I will say this is the same with this kind of product. So this is a Blemish Drying Lotion by Zabana Essentials. I, now, I think this is now my third um, Blemish product. So that's interesting. Um, I love some of the ones I got. It says dip a cotton swab in the green clay sediment, apply to inflamed areas, allow products to sit for a few hours or overnight, and then rinse with warm waters. Treats and heals blemishes, reduces redness, inflammation, 
infused with French green clay, moringa leaf, burdock root, aloe vera. We all know I love aloe. Witch hazel. Um, I find it's interesting. If you can see, there's like a gray kind of color. Um, I'm kind of excited about this because it says reduces redness, but I don't think they're meaning for you to put this all over your face. Um, I don't very often get like a full pimple and I recently just found a great, great product for um, getting rid of spots. But, so this is a $12 value. So this is very interesting. Um, I, I kind of like this, although at this point now with three blemish controls, I don't know how many more I need. Um, next up is the lipstick and this is what you got to pick the color. So there were different colors and this is what you got to personalize. This is a $30 value. This seems like a very small package. This is fruit pigmented pomegranate oil and anti-aging lipstick by 100% pure, super moisturizing shea butter. So cute packaging. Um, I think it's sealed. So I'm gonna have to figure out how to open it. I may have to, I don't know. My, my hands are also oily from I put on a oil. So I will save this till the end. I will come back to this because I think I'm gonna have to pause. I don't know how to open that. All right, next up are some nail strips. I do like nail strips. Um, you looks like you could have gotten different colors. Um, these are really cute. I, I'm not sure whether I wish I would have gotten different, the different colors or not. This is a value of $10. Um, and these are by Nana Coco. So these are really cute, kind of like a champagne. Um, and I've, I have done Color Street before, um, and I really like them. So I will probably put these on. I've actually been thinking about getting some more. So these are going to be like a pretty neutral. So I like those, and I will definitely be giving those a try uh, probably this weekend. So it looks like, yeah, these are it. Those are the different shapes you get. So those are really pretty. I will definitely use those. Happy to have them. The last product is Q-tips. I don't know how I feel about getting a box of Q-tips. Um, I mean, you can't complain. I will use Q-tips. Um, this is a $12 value. I, I don't know. So this is charcoal infused cotton swabs. A must-have for your makeup and skincare toolkit. These charcoal charcoal swabs can be used for multiple cosmetic tasks, including fixing eyeliner, applying dry or liquid products. So I I mean this is they paired it with this, so you have Q-tips, which is kind of cute. I just don't know if I would value these at thirty dollars. Um. Anyway. So I'm going to pause and see if I can figure out how to open the lipstick. All right, we are back. So cute packaging. Um, it's kind of, it's got a tree on it, which I'm not sure whether that's coming up or not. I remember not being able to tell what color I should get or not get. The pictures were hard to tell. Um, so I just took a stab at it and that was a very, very creamy, creamy color. Um, let's give that a whirl. And I don't really know. I never can tell my viewfinder um, how that comes out. But I think I will like that color. I like that. Um, it's very creamy. So, I would say very creamy. Like, it, like it's already kind of like... So, what do you think about this box? I'm often kind of critical um, when it's my first box, when, um, you know, it's 30, I think it was $33 total, $31.95 plus a little tax. Um, I'm kind of torn. I had already paused this box just because I knew it was going to renew before I saw what was in this. I've also paused all my other 100% beauty skincare boxes because I'm just up to the brim. Um, and I need to take a break. So unless it was like a lifestyle box or a mix of stuff, I paused all my beauty for now. So let me know what you think. For me, I don't know if I find that this was $33 value. Of course, the products add up to way more than $30. Um, I don't know. Definitely will use the nails. I mean, I will definitely use the Q-tips. 
I just feel like in a $33 beauty box, I want my six products to be something other than Q-tips. And I do not find this is a $12 value, not worth $12 to me. I am very interested in these guys, so I will definitely use these. Definitely will keep the blemish control around. Uh, but now that I have three different blemish control treatments, I will. I am set for blemish control treatments. Um, I do like the color. I just don't do lipstick very much. So I'm interested to see in the mirror what it looks like and if it wears more like a chapstick. But I do think that that's a very, very pretty color. Um, the blush, I'm not quite sure whether I'm going to try that. I'm very interested if any of you have used sheet blush. And I'm still not quite sure. Let's see. It says gently remove the protective paper from the applicator sponge to reveal the adhesive. Press the sponge applicator with the adhesive side down to pick up a sheet. Dab along the cheek to transfer the color. When the adhesive loosens stickiness, peel layer to reveal additional adhesive sheets. I love that this is made in the USA. So this is made in the USA. No, it's, well, never mind. It's designed in the USA, made in Taiwan. So then I don't even know why we have to put designed in the USA. I don't, I don't know. Anyway, very interesting box. I'm happy to have tried it. Um, I do love that they come with a product card. So, again, let me know what you think. Um, what, yeah, what do you think? Anyway, I hope you guys have a great weekend, and I will talk to you soon. All right, hello. I thought we'd do a little try-on. I have the nails on, so um, I'm happy to have them. They're going to kill my desire to get some Color Street. Um, Color Street are kind of my favorite, and so these were really thick, and so I'm questioning how well they're going to stay on. They were also done in a weird manner, so I really had to kind of just uh, randomly put them on. I couldn't do like every other one, or I really were just, I was at, um, kept, to whatever they had. So I, I like them. I think they're pretty. They are really thick. I'm interested to see, especially how the, this one stays on. Um, some of the stickers I wouldn't even stick, and I did prep my nails with alcohol, etc. Super happy to have them though. Um, it'll take away my need to get anything else. I also thought I would try the blush. Why not? I'm paying for it. I might as well try it. So the this comes with a sticky pad. Um, and let's see. Press the sponge applicator with adhesive dab along the cheek. I'm just curious of why I put it on the paper. Why not just have it the traditional uh, so I don't even know if that's coming off at all. Uh, interesting. So I'm happy to have tried it. Like even if I'm like rubbing it on my arm, I don't know if any powder is coming off. So I'm not quite sure what I think about these. Um, I will try them again in the morning. I don't, I don't know if anything's coming off of them. So it's very interesting. Cool packaging, whatnot. I don't know. I'm not sure anything's coming off, but hey. Um, I'm excited to try it. I do love this color. And this formula does wear as a chapstick. I mean, you can still see that I have it on, but uh, I like this color, and so I'm happy with that product. So overall, I think I'm happy with this box. Um, I'm just used to other ones like Fast It Fun and Ipsy that where you get like just leaps and bounds more. But I'm really happy to try the new product. This will really like kill my need for more nail stickers. Because for my nails, my nails are so crazy. I think I have lots of ridges, and my nails are just, even if I got gel at a salon, the gel chips within like five days or less. So um, these probably won't stay on long, but this will kill my need to go buy some. So I think they're pretty, happy to have them. I like the lipstick. Um, again, excited for to try these tonight. I don't think the blush is working. Um, either that or I don't know what I'm doing. So if you've ever used these sheets, let me know. But I rub them up and down my arms, and I'm not really seeing much. Although I guess maybe there is some peachy dust kind of here. But anyway, thank you so much for watching.